welcome virgos virgos it is june it is june virgos all right virgos let's see what is going on remember these readings are extended i love you guys please like and share virgos it's your month mm, it's the energy of um balance virgos so it's your month finally things are going to be trying to come to an end and cycle down virgos i'm hoping for you guys if you want to see the extended of this reading is a dollar 99 use the join button and it will take you over to the other side um i do love you guys please like and share this uh, video um okay oh my god virgos bam 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 it is the energy of the month and it's your month the first week is going to be very very good now this is the energy of temperance and it is the energy of the month and it's also the energy of your virgo so the first week is going to be good in this month the second week the energy of the star this is absolutely fabulous this is really positive really good um the double energy is duality you're balancing out if you have some sort of health issue if you are going through some sort of a problem and you're bringing a situation to an end virgos it's as if you find out that it was a distasteful situation that you got involved with you want to bring it to an end okay very distasteful situation and i see the energy of the wheel of fortune where you're bringing a situation to an end in order for your fortune to return to you so it's as if you know whatever that was happening in transpire you have hurt energy you are going to be uh, successfully overcoming a situation it's coming to an end and your fortune is going to be returned hurt hair hurt and fire okay so no water no emotional let's see what else is going to be coming up behind this so we see that your burdens the ten of ones you're going to be balancing this out in the month of uh, in the first week of june um new love is coming in virgos yes 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 new love is coming in um there's no question i see your start new love oh yes right in your house virgos new love is coming in okay uh the three of pentacles a lot of you virgos are going to be working with a capricorn in order to resolve a situation and you're going to be helping a capricorn out because you recognize that you find out the truth behind why a capricorn was treated so unfairly two of cups a lot of you virgos are falling in love with a capricorn yeah <laughs> a lot of you virgos are going to be wanting to you either had an affair with a capricorn and you're going to be reuniting with a capricorn but whatever is happening virgos i see you could have had an affair with a capricorn in the past and it's coming back i i think you virgos was very in love with this capricorn also okay it's a capricorn that you know and you were in very in love with this capricorn so it is the love of your life um there is something between you and this capricorn virgo that you got pissed off with this person and then you're recognizing my heart can't stop i can't stop thinking about this person yeah it is okay it is as if your heart can't stop thinking about this person whatever is happening whatever is transpiring virgos is as if your heart can't stop thinking about this person is as if um there is so much going on for you and this 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 love this love that you have is as if you have seen this person and right away you both connected on a spiritual level you both connected because your heart chakra breathes there are chakra is is a twin flame soulmate relationship for a lot of you virgo some is uh, some of you is a twin flame some is you a soulmate okay 
this person is from a past life. You have known this person from a past life. And it is a Capricorn. For some of you, it's a Capricorn man. For some of you, it's a Capricorn woman. But it's as if temperance is that you met this person and there was some sort of a problem. The energy of the Ten of Wands. Okay. Hold on, Vargas, because I have been going uh, for a long time uh, with this. And I think my battery is going to be. See, I have a good sense. I got a good sense. Good sense of humor. I, I kind of felt it. I had 32%, but yet still, this reading is going to be long. So, Virgos, whatever this Capricorn is, you, your heart is still open for this Capricorn. You created a whole lot of prob problems for this Capricorn and now you're regretting it in a sense that I never know the reason why other people was working against this Capricorn and actually this Capricorn is not, you know, you know, they're, they're just cool and you regret it. There it is. You want to go back. Um, it's a situation where some of you Virgos think that this Capricorn was not, or this person. It's, it, the center is a Capricorn, but this person. Um, um, you were having a lot of burdens that you had to put down. And this is happening in the first week where it's some sort of a burdens. You were dealing with a whole lot of burdens with your kids, problems with your kids, uh, um, problems with your kids, uh, um, mother, that sort of a thing. Uh, yeah, here. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> all right. Um, Virgo, Virgo women. Virgo women, Virgo women, Virgo women, problems with your children. Okay. Um, the three of ones. Um, the three of ones. I told you it's a Capricorn woman. A lot of you, whether it's your child, mother, or this Capricorn woman of a child, you were in love with this person. It could have been a relationship. Okay. And you're going to be finding out that a, a cancer stole a lot of money from a Capricorn. You and a cancer could have stolen a lot of money from a Capricorn. It's a sad situation. <laughs> very, very sad situation. A whole lot of money was stolen from a Capricorn. And I see regrets. You regretted that you worked together with a, with a, with a, with a, uh, a cancer against a Capricorn. And you regret the situation. But... Uh, uh, it is what it is. It is as if uh, a new love is coming in. You, 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 and I think it's a situation where you Virgos met this Capricorn, and you think that this person was full of S H I T, and you kind of stay together and work with other people against this person. And now you're recognizing Jesus. This woman hadn't done anything basically. Um, you know, they're who they are. They just keep to their self. There's nothing really wrong with people just keeping to themselves. And I see you regret it because you recognize now that the cancer was lying. 
you recognize now that the cancer was lying and you regret everything that you have done. A lot of you, um, Aries could have used you to work against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. It's coming up as a Capricorn woman and to steal some sort of a data and information from a Capricorn woman and you recognize uh, shit. This, yeah, is wrong. Um, and I see you Virgos. Uh, you're very sorry, but this woman is like pissed. This woman is like really, really pissed, Virgos. Um, you know, what has happened and transpired. This lady is very, very upset, Virgos. And you're recognizing, um, Jesus, you're not regretting what you have done. It could be your child's mother. Uh, it could be um, with a Capricorn and her child. You created a lot of burdens um, because you uh, were paid and you were lied to by a cancer. A cancer had lied to you. And now you Virgos are very, very upset because you're recognizing Jesus. This woman has never done me anything. This woman has only done something um, to help me and to advise me of what was going on. So I see new love is coming in and it has to do with a Capricorn. And I see a lot of you are going to be um, really recognizing Jesus. Um, I worked against this person. This person never get me, uh, did me anything. And some of you are going to be having wants to return to your Capricorn mother, um, children, mother. Uh, you want to, but there is so much problems that you had, but you recognize that this is the person for you. New love is coming in. And I see that an Aries is, um, trying to connect with you and you're like, no, thank you. And um, whatever is happening, some of you Virgos are your mind. You want to heal a situation with a Capricorn. Some of you Virgos wants to heal the situation with the Capricorns because you recognize the lies and the deceptiveness of uh, uh, this cancer. You recognize that the a cancer in the past had lied to you. And the real deceptiveness of this cancer. So new love is coming in and it's coming in. And I see you're going to be successful. You're going to be happy that um, someone who you really love and care about, you want to, um, you know, this new love that is coming in is, is really you want to work with this new love. You want to, you you know, this, this person is from another lifetime. Okay. And um, I see that. If you are in a relationship and you got in a relationship with the Aries, you you regret every moment of it. So your Virgos is going to be down. You're going to be successfully um, overcoming a situation and help a Capricorn woman to heal a situation by returning some sort of a data or alerting this Capricorn woman um, what has happened and transpired. A cycle is going to be cut over for an Aries. And for some of you, a cycle is going to be over between you and a Capricorn uh, woman that you are in a relationship with. It could be your wife. Um, it's going to be over because they're going to be, you know, this person has separated because of something what you have done. And then they're going to be completing it. So new love is coming in and I see the energy of the world. It is, uh, um, you're going to be returning. So this love that is coming in, um, is a Capricorn man or woman, and it is someone who you um, met in the past, and this person is coming back, or you're going to be um, reconnecting with this person, and it is a, it could be your child's mother that is a Capricorn, Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn, and I see you want to heal the situation with this person. And um, this person is a past life love. This person is a soulmate or a twin flame. And you want to heal the situation with this person. I see you regretted how you have treated a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. And um, you're going to be successful over a, a Cancer and a Scorpion. A Aries here and a Cancer um, for what they have done. Okay. All right. So uh, let's go in here and see what is happening. 
So, mm, um, fortune, fortune, you're going to be balancing out your money. Fortune is going to be returning, uh, Virgos. A lot of you Virgos want to communicate, um, with a lover, um, or your soulmate or twin flame. And I see you're going to be drawing in your soulmate or twin flame. Okay. A lot of you are hoping and praying to find and hope that this person uh, react to your email or your mail. A tower moment is coming down. Um, and this tower moment is as if you Virgos are hoping for some sort of an end between you and your child's mother. A corporation institution is now going to be recognizing uh, what was happening in Transparent Aulon. So... Oh, yeah. So, Virgos, um, you are now recognizing, you are hoping to reunite with someone in another country. You're definitely uh, want to reunite with someone in another country because you want to tell this person and ask for, you know, their excuses for something. A tower moment is coming down for you, Virgos, and uh, a government institution is now recognizing what you Virgos have done um, to a, Capri a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman and uh, how they have took a whole lot of money from this lady. Okay, so they are now going to be recognizing you Virgos could be with the one helping to resolve the situation and recognizing that a whole lot of money was stolen from this woman and her child. I told you. I told you, Virgos, I told you, Virgos, I told you, Virgos, that new love is coming in and you're healing a past life situation. And it could be a situation at the work floor. Um, and it is you women, new love is coming in. And uh, you women, Virgo women that work for a government institution and corporation, you're going to be making sure to reinstate a Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn woman and her child information because you Virgos recognize that this woman information and this business information was um, used. Virgo men, you are going to be um, meeting up with a new love. I see that um, you're going to be successful with a lawsuit um, uh, Virgos, um, women, but men not. So Virgo women will be successful in a lawsuit. Virgo men not, Virgo businessmen not. I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you, Virgos, new love, okay? And you want to reunite. I told you, Virgos, you Virgos wants to reunite. You Virgos want to reunite with, um, a soulmate or a twin flame uh, in another country, okay? It is a situation where you met this person, a whole lot of people uh, come in, uh, Aries. So you met, you met this person. And what happened um, by meeting this person, you recognize that this person... You recognize that this person was, uh, ooh, luck is coming in. You recognize um, that this person, you have known this person from another lifetime. And you recognize a deep soul connection with this person. This was just unbelievable. This deep soul connection was just unbelievable. It's, it's, you have never felt this with someone else. You have been around the block, but whoever this person is, uh, this deep sense of uh, connection, it was soul, it was a soul connection. It was not uh, a shade of love on the outside, you know, uh, so you have this chemistry and that's it. No, it was a soul connection. You connect with this person so deep. But, an Aries, an Aries man from another country. Um, I've created a whole lot of mess. Okay, this Aries man knew that you were in some sort of a financial problem, and what this Aries man did 
was to use you to get some information um, from this woman. And now you're recognizing, oh my God, this Aries man. And it's because you needed some sort of a financial help for some of you, not for all of you. Some of you needed some financial help. You were having like, you were like, you need to, uh, to pay child support and that sort of a thing. And that was, and this man knew, this man is a manipulator. He, he like, he looks for people who are you, who needs financial help and use them to manipulate and do his dirty deed. And, you know, whatever that was going on and whatever that was transpiring, I see that a whole lot of you, um, you know, it was, it, it was a situation where this person in Vigil, and now you Virgo men are now thinking and realizing, oh my God, um, you know, look what they have done to this person. A whole lot of you Virgo businessmen are now very worried because they're now investigating a Cancer and a Scorpion and an Aries and recognizing what a Cancer, a Scorpion and an Aries have done to a Capricorn. And they're now investigating it and recognizing how these people had collaborated. And I see that you're going to be successfully overcoming a cancer and a scorpion. You're going to be successfully uh, overcoming this person. I see um, a lot of you are waiting for some sort of a news to some sort of a problem. I see your pleasure seeking. Stop pleasure seeking. If you want to talk to this person, just talk to this person. I see you recognize who is this Capricorn, this Cancer overseas is pleasure seeking with you. And they're recognizing what a Scorpion woman have done. And I see that uh, you, Virgo, are going to be successfully overcoming um, this Scorpion woman. Whoever the Scorpion woman is, um, the Scorpion woman could be from another country and they could be investigating this person. So... There's a whole lot that is happening. Whole lot. So um, your luck could be coming back. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So your luck is going to be coming back. I see a lot of you um were having some sort of a legal issue you're waiting for some sort of a response you could be someone who were doing some sort of an investigation i see a lot of you are open and praying to reunite with a love and whoever this love is is the love of your life okay a tower moment is coming down and they're going to be recognizing that a whole lot of money was paid in order to get some sort of a data and information of a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn person. They're going to be recognizing this. And I see a lot of you, Leo, uh, Virgo businessmen is going to be uh, desperate because uh, this, the, 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 it's as if there's a legal situation and the judge is going to be recognizing that you signed a contract. Um, you were paid in order to get to connect with this person and you signed a contract. You were trying to ruin this person's reputation and you were aware of what you were doing. So the judge is going to be a saying, no Virgos, especially Virgo businessmen. No, you were aware of what you were doing. You signed the contract and the person did a good job. You are just, uh, um, trying to get out of a situation and you must be honest with yourself and recognize. And I see, they, um, I see you Virgos are really, um, on the investigation with some sort of a problem. And it's because of a scorpion woman that creates some sort of an issue and got you involved. And I see, um, that an Aries woman and a Taurus woman, a Aries woman and a Taurus woman had gotten you in some serious problem. And I see now you're desperate. Um, because a Capricorn is speaking up and you're desperate because you went and connect with a Capricorn business and try to get some sort of a data of a Capricorn business to give to a Scorpion woman. And the Dutch is going to say, yes, you were aware of what you have done. It, there is no question. So I see whoever this person is, is going to be standing 
up and you Virgos are now regretting what you have done and I see a cancer they're going to be recognizing what this cancer have done they're going to be recognizing and I tell you this cancer what this cancer is and I see um, you Virgos and this cancer had collaborated together and trust me there is no win-win in the situation the only success is that you Virgo women are going to be successfully overcoming the scorpion woman okay this this the scorpion person you're going to be successful so you young um young virgo ladies you could be under some sort of an investigation especially if you a uh, virgo ladies had help and uh, um leo woman a leo woman and a sagittarian woman to get some sort of a data and information about a capricorn business you guys are going to be under some serious trouble because i see um that this is going to be escalating out of control and they're going to be deciding to pick up each and every person for what they have done and they are going to be using you people to make an example not to um cross the line because they are going to be showing you up so a tower moment is coming down some sort of a news is coming in some sort of the blockages that was created is going to be released a lot of you Virgos are, you know, was paid to get some sort of a documentation about a Capricorn and they're going to be finding out that you were paid. A lot of you are going to be um, speaking up that you were paid. A Sagittarian paid you to get some sort of information. A lot of you, um, your soulmate or twin flame is going to be returning. Um, this person, um, I see an Aries wants to reconnect with the you Virgos and you Virgos are like, no, you Virgos are going to be turning down an Aries. Um, so I see, I don't know whether you're a man or a woman. An Aries wanted, an Aries woman wanted to reconnect with you Virgos and you're saying no. You could have seen this Aries woman or could have had something with this Aries woman, but you're saying no. I don't know. It's an Aries woman. You're saying no. Ah, uh, the Wheel of Fortune. You Virgo businessmen are wishing that you could have turned back the ends of time. But now, you Virgos that is with a cancer, I think you're going to get yourself out of a situation and let the cancer fall because you realize how serious a situation is. And I see you Virgos are going to be pulling out yourself. Now, I can't, I can't sir, but for some of you, because it's at the workplace, so. Some sort of a business deal that you had a cancer. You Virgo are going to pull yourself out in order to get out because you recognize how huge this thing has exploded. So I see a lot of you women are going to be recognizing and it's going to be really in some sort of a desperation because you recognize that a Leo person use and you help a Leo person to take a lot of money on the false pretend from a uh capricorn oh yeah it's a capricorn woman oh yeah ten toes <laughs> oh dear oh dear oh dear <laughs> that's the energy of the ten toes oh it's a capricorn oh you want to reconnect with a capricorn you some of you mess up a Capricorn you went to do business with this person but you were paid by a um, Sagittarian and a Leo to get some sort of a connection with a Capricorn businesswoman now you're regretting this because they recognize what you Virgos have done and now you want to go back to this 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 business associate because you recognize that this person was very good yeah but don't do it this person nope this person don't want to have any association with you and once his business if it's love um you are going to be you and your um capricorn mother I see a light flash in my camera, so that's why. You and your Capricorn mother are 
it's going to be your, your Capricorn man is going to be reconnected. I see a light flash in my in that camera. I'm going to set it up again. Okay. So what is happening, Virgos? I, 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 I now I see the light flashing in my camera, and I want to go find out because it's not hooked up to anything. Anyway, I'm gonna do something later. So, Virgos, it's just a lot that is going. But your Capricorn uh, child's mother, I see you, Virgos, are going to be reconnecting in the second week with your um, Capricorn um baby mother okay you're going to be connected and some of you virgos have to pay a capricorn out of a contract they're going to be ordering you to pay a capricorn out of um a capricorn businesswoman out of our contract because you knew exactly and you signed the contract for a year and you knew exactly what you were doing okay yeah, a lot of you Virgos have thought that you were going to be overcoming the situation, but it it has gone and spin out of. Uh, you should not, uh, you know. And it's another thing, Virgo businessmen. You should have been honest about yourself because you were not very honest, and you were already caught. Um, and you tried to use a lawyer to go after this woman when this woman hadn't done anything, and you are the one who have sold this woman. Um um uh, references because the um sagittarian paid you a lot of money in order to connect with this capricorn businesswoman in order to get her um her references to give to this leo so virgos you know and the judge is going to say no pay this lady out of her contract because it is wrong what you have done um yeah they're investigating a cancer and a leo and i see your virgos are going to be so happy um and um this cancer and this aries and leo was kind of playing a game or something like that but they're going to be caught okay all righty let's check of the houses and see what is transpiring a tower moment is coming down for a sagittarian um, they're going to be recognizing what a Sagittarian has done and how a Sagittarian has uh, falsified and blocked and took some money. So um, you're going to be balancing out a situation in the first house within yourself and within a situation where some of you Virgos that was in a relationship with an Aries, you only went with this person because this Aries was financial stable. And now you Virgos wants to get out of this relationship. You could have gotten out and the Aries is buying you, buying you back into this relationship and trying to manipulate you in giving you materialistic stability. And I see you want to get out. And you want to go as far. And I see when you get out of this relationship, you're going to relocate so you don't um, connect with this Aries anymore. This Aries have no control and connection with you. So I see a lot of you Virgos is having that. Then um, um, when we look at the energy of the um, Tor uh, Leos, mm, um, we are recognizing that you and the Leos, whatever is happening in transpiring is that you got documentation for the Leos and it's a Sagittarian woman that pay you to get some sort of a documentation for a Leo. Now, whoever this Leo is, this Leo could have had a child for you or is your little um, uh, side piece chick or you could have fallen in love with this Leo. And this Leo is manipulating you, okay? It's the same situation you have gone through, Virgo. The Leo is manipulating you, and you're going to be recognizing it's not the first person that manipulate me this way. The Leo knows how to use sex to get people, okay? It's someone who is, uh, they think that intimacy is uh, how, uh, yeah, sorry, uh, yeah. So, Leo, uh, deal with it. Um, by um, a boat scutter, Sagittarian. A tower moment is coming down on a Sagittarian. Whoever the Sagittarian is and whatever is happening, a tower moment is coming down on a Sagittarian. And they're going to be recognizing how much money a Sagittarian has paid to work against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn a woman and her child so that um, they would lose their status. So, and... Uh, 
it's because the Sagittarian woman was the one who sold and give um, people this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman status and it's because of hate, hate. And this woman, this woman don't even know the Sagittarian person. And if it's someone who she knows, she would have never been um, connecting with the Sagittarian. The Sagittarian person have a vendetta against uh, um, this Capricorn woman. And that's why she did it, okay? Then we're looking at Tauruses, and I see a Taurus lawyer or a Taurus, no, a Taurus lawyer or a Taurus is uh, now desperate and it's a Taurus woman because you Virgos could have had some sort of an affair and you Virgos was playing the floor. floor. You Virgos was playing the floor with a Leo, you were playing the floor um, with an Aries and you were playing the floor with a Taurus. It's like you have these three women and you were bam, bam, bam all over the place, Virgos, with these women. I don't... Okay. All right. So uh, your materialistic house, Virgos, is... um uh Your materialistic house is such, is the end, the, the, the star, but that is not, not about money. You might be successful over a legal issue. But I see you could be, you wish you did not add a, a gone in a relationship with an Aries. You wish that, okay? And you want to get rid of this Aries, but it's as if this Aries tie you in some way, okay? Uh, then when we look at your house, oh yeah, oh yeah. You Virgos are spreading your love to the Leo a Sagittarius, but the Leon the Sagittarius is actually supporting you financial and the Leo and the Sagittarius, some of you could be having kids with them and you're um, getting a financial stone from the Aries because uh, you Leo men always, <laughs> and that is it with you Leo men. You, you Leo men always have like one woman that, has your heart, but you have like three women and all of the women is for something. One that you see as truly your wife and nothing else and children that you have kids with, you will end up being with another woman uh, after you have kids with one woman. But here you, you Virgos are, are, are you know, and I can't see a Virgos and a Aries in a relationship, but it's what it is. But I, it is not, it's about you getting materialistic support from this Aries, basically, because she's, she's there um, financially helping you, uh, Virgos. That is what the Aries is there doing, helping you, Virgos, financially. Um, but you have kids with a Leo and a Sagittarian. <laughs> okay, Virgos, it's your thing. But Virgos, um, you are having some sort of a legal issue. And it has to do with a Capricorn because it's something that you did against a Capricorn. And a Aries paying you to do something. A Aries and a Sagittarian ask you to um, get some sort of a uh, information uh, from a Capricorn but you end up uh, falling in love with this Capricorn because you met this Capricorn like in a office scenery for some of you because yeah that's where you met this Capricorn in some sort of an office scenery and it is because you were um Connected, but you met this Capricorn and then recognizing, um, you have a soul connection with this Capricorn, but, uh, you, they manipulate you. That's all I can say, Virgo. They manipulate you. So, mm -hmm. all right. So you and this Capricorn, I see some of you Virgos want to do something so that this Capricorn get back a whole lot of money that a Sagittarian and a Leo has stolen from this Capricorn. And I see you, Virgo, are going to be making sure, especially if you are working in a government institution, organization, you're going to be working in collaboration in order um, for a, a Capricorn woman and her child regain uh, money, but also regain 
connection with her child because it's as if the Sagittarius and this Leo is the one that has blocked this lady child and has been creating a whole lot of blocks to this lady and her child and you Leos are going to be regaining the stability and balance then we are now recognizing you know, um, the Gemini, the house of the Gemini lawsuit at the workplace, lawsuit with business that is going to be transpiring desperation because you um Geminis are having a lawsuit because of a Capricorn, something that you did to a Capricorn and you share as Capricorn details without mm, the request. So you could have access and get a Capricorn details on the false pretend and share it or use it. And you are in some legal issue because they're investigating you Virgos and a scorpion. Uh, you're ending the relationship with this Aries. I, it, it says, if I don't care how much money you're giving me, no, I don't want it. Let it go, please. Um, let it go. It just use the block. You just block people. You think about it. I know you Virgos, you're going to be really thinking about it, but you're going to be thinking, no. Nope. It's as if this Aries, maybe you are in a relationship with this Aries and you're, um, no. And if this is an Aries businessman or so, you're going to be blocked. You need to block this person. If you don't block this person, you're going to be constantly on this wheel because this person is a manipulator. He doesn't have any money anymore because he can't steal from anyone else in order to pay you all this big money to get things. So I see you're going to finally get rid of this Aries businessman. Hmm. Okay. Then when we look at the house of family, some sort of a karmatic situation from a family is going to be returning. And it is a situation where you're a father figure to you. I've created some sort of a problem. And this is as if this father figure knew what was happening because this father figure knew that um, a Capricorn um, that was working or connected with them in some sort of a business was your soulmate and your twin flame and the part and this father figure this gemini is is an um is a cruel person this gemini knew that the taurus virgo or capricorn was your twin flame it's like a twin flame yeah and he intervened um by creating chaos that you never get with this person. And I see you're going to be finding out. And I think you already found out. And you're like trying to wait until uh, the right time to go and rekindle. And I think it might be the end of June that you're going to be turning up at this Capricorn or either calling this Capricorn out to the blue so that the person had to pick up the telephone or either turning up at the person house and is going to be um or going out with a person inviting the person out and it's going to be um speaking to this person it is it is a crazy thing i i have to say this is very um crazy but i you know your heart is so connected with this um person a lot of you virgos is going to be ending some sort of a relationship with a cancer because you recognize that this cancer has been dragging you down the wrong side of the road really dragging you down the wrong side of the road and uh, i see you're going to be letting it go okay let it go um in the house of marriage um relationship i see you're going to be choosing a capricorn uh, there is some sort of a legal issue. I see. Yes, I I see you, Virgos. Wants to, uh, you wants to reconnect with a Capricorn. This is the person you want to be with. You know it is. Uh, you think about this person so much, but you you're afraid, and it, it's as if you know how to reach this person, but you're afraid because. You know, this person know what you did, but you're afraid how this person is going to be reacting to you. So, Scorpion. Um, Scorpion women, a lot of you Virgos are clearing up some sort of a karmatic um, uh, problem with a Scorpion woman. And this Scorpion woman, you could be married to the Scorpion woman, but she took you down for a lot, Virgo, or she's going to be taking you down 
for a lot now I got it I got it <laughs> uh, there is a lot that is going on let's see what is coming out um the intention so 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 the rite of passage creating a threshold so the rite of passage is that you are creating a threshold to end a relationship with an Aries woman okay then we see um, um, birthing a new uh, age, yes, and it's because you want the love of your heart. You want to be with a person that you truly, really love. You want to, some of you want to be with one person, and that is really going to be um, this new love that is coming, and you're going to be reunited with the love of your life. Okay. Um. Um, mountain, where are you going? I see that a lot of you Virgo are praying and open, um, for some sort of a situation to to end, and it's going to be coming to an end. You Virgos, um, have some sort of an issue with um, it could be a bank, a financial, or a tax company, and you are hoping for the situation to be resolved. Um, what you Virgos have, okay? Well, I have the unicorn innocent. So now, a lot of you Virgos are going to be recognizing that um, someone who you have worked against at the workplace, um, and uh, Capricorn, you're going to be finding out that this person is innocent, okay? A innocent. This person, what they were saying about this person is not true. This person is innocent to the lies that these people were creating around this person is because of jealousy. And you're going to be recognizing. Sanctify. Um, a lot of you um Virgos are going to be they're investigating. If you Virgos is in a relationship. Or have some sort of a contract with a cancer, they're investigating you and this cancer. They know that you and this cancer has created um some sort of a contract and was and and have some sort of a business contract and they're investigating you and um this cancer and they recognize that you and this cancer have created some sort of a contract and you're satisfied it's as if you're releasing yourself from this contract because this, this is really um, like um, you could be in a sector and uh, it's a cancer out of a sector and you yeah, get it out. Okay. Um, rebirt. Uh, you, you're rebirting because you're healing some sort of a karmatic situation between you and a um, scorpion. You're definitely healing a karma that you and a scorpion whether it's your ex-wife or what you're ending um this by a rebirth releasing yourself from a scorpion and rebirthing yeah <laughs> okay all right virgos i do love you guys and i want to say thank you for being here namaste